Queensland, Australia, a news helicopter captures dramatic video of a rescue on the high seas. Skipper Malcolm Dixon is in serious trouble. His front sails are shredded, his motor is dead, and he is drifting into treacherous waters. The boat is named after his two-year-old daughter, Lee, who is huddled below deck. Malcolm sends out an urgent SOS, but the signal is so weak, the Coast Guard has difficulty pinpointing his exact location. Two rescue boats speed to the area, but the first passes right by Malcolm without even seeing him. He struggles to guide his damaged vessel into calmer waters, but it's too late. A 20-foot wave slams into Malcolm's boat, tossing him into the churning sea. Grabbing a safety line, he pulls his way back on board and frantically searches for his daughter. He is relieved to find her below deck, frightened but unharmed. Although the mast has collapsed, Malcolm's battered sloop stays afloat and begins drifting into calmer waters. But nearby, the second rescue boat is getting hammered by the ferocious surf. Suddenly, a gigantic wall of water pounds the boat, flipping it upside down. Two crewmen are swept into the sea. Incredibly, they manage to fight their way back onto their boat. Now it's the rescuers who need to be rescued. Thankfully, a Coast Guard helicopter arrives on the scene. The pilot carefully maneuvers the chopper into position. One of the crewmen reaches out, but a wave knocks him off balance. The pilot moves in for another try. This time, the man is able to grab hold. Now it's his partner's turn. The pilot lowers the chopper, knowing the boat could sink at any second. The man reaches out and slips. But somehow, he manages to hang on. After several anxious moments, the crewman is helped aboard and lifted to safety. Also safe and sound are Malcolm and his daughter. They are towed to shore by the Coast Guard. Were it not for the courageous efforts of the chopper pilot, this day would have ended in tragedy.